Whoa, 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 what do we have here? My name is Brandon Polito, I'm a realtor part of the Prasad Group, and today we are touring the community of North Lake at Ovation in Winter Garden. Today we're taking a tour of the Duval model. I'm not gonna waste anybody's time. If you watch my past video of the Griffin, we're gonna look at the big brother of the actual Griffin model, which I'll put a picture of the video here so you guys can see. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like if you enjoy this content. I got a lot of info for you guys, so let's make it to the Duval model. Let's go. All right, we are here. I actually came to record this home yesterday and I did not like the way it came out at all. So I said, if I'm gonna do this tour, we're gonna do it right. This one is actually a five bedroom, four and a half bath home, 3552 square feet. In comparison to that Griffin, this is substantially bigger. So I really, really wanna go over all the details as to where if you're considering about buying this home, after watching this video, you'll pretty much have a good idea whether this would be the better fit for you and your family or the Griffin model. So of course, pretty standard. We do have a very nice front porch here, right? Different elevations. I can include photos of how the elevations look uh, regarding that, but I absolutely love super, super tall door. Again, this is Ashton Woods. You know that they do not cut corners when it comes to quality and, and the options that they give you in the home. As soon as we enter, before we even go anywhere else, I want you guys to take all of this in. We're gonna make a right, and we'll actually be greeted by a nice little hidden full bedroom with its own personal bath. So as soon as we come in here, dimensions, dimensions, I'm gonna include all the dimensions and details in the actual description. So if you guys are seriously interested in this model, you're gonna get all the information that you absolutely need. Very, very nice size bedroom. I'm gonna let you guys look again. As soon as we walk in, come on, to the left, we're gonna have our full bath. So of course, everything is gonna be granite. They do offer a lot of options and upgrades in this home, which I will go over everything with you guys, tiling all the way to the tippy tippy top, ceramic wood look tile flooring. I love how the car looks sitting outside. <laughs> um, anyways, let's get back to it. 10 feet doors, 10 foot. Um, you know, I've had quite a few clients actually inquire about this home specifically. They are building this, again, I'm in Winter Garden, but they are building this in Mineola and other places. It's a little bit cheaper in Mineola, a little more expensive starting in Winter Garden, but I'm gonna show you the exact location as to where this community resides. You're pretty much five minutes away from absolutely everything. Top rated schools, Windermere High School is literally like 10, 15 minutes away. Let's get back to it. Of course, this is gonna be our formal dining here, right? Very nice and separated. And we can see a little sneak peek that they do have a butler's pantry through this way. And this is actually where we're gonna start with the initial optional upgrade. So you can actually flip this around. This butler's pantry can actually be pushed on this side. And then you're pretty much gonna get a pantry the size from here all the way there. So it's gonna be a very, very deep pantry and the butler's, uh, butler's pantry is gonna be here. Remember that as soon as we get into the uh, kitchen here this is just absolutely ridiculous very very nice and similar styling to the griffin with that open to below floor plan gourmet kitchen of course and i love that they actually added these little cabinets up there um, to kind of maximize the space usage that they have microwave and oven in the wall granite 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 everything is top shape you can actually extend this uh island as well a few feet uh, to make it just a little bit bigger if you did want to and right here this is where we're greeted with our open to below i'm gonna estimate this is about 17 feet up because i know the first floor here is nine four and then the ceiling height from the second floor up is like eight so that's roughly uh, 17 or so but again i'm gonna go over all the optional upgrades upstairs as well when we get there but first we'll just start with this honestly the home the way it is base is just beautiful you wouldn't even you don't even have to necessarily do any upgrades unless you really really wanted to but um, what you can do is actually create another entrance here you have dual french doors that lead to the actual lanai outside and you can change this door here for a nice uh, dual french door as well very very nice spacing again another little nook right you can actually add a a den in here so you can pretty much come back to the front 
convert this to a den with a nice little door or leave it the way it is. If you want actual information and details about pricing as to how much all these options are gonna cost you, just make sure you reach out to me. I have all the info. My name is Brandon. I'll put the number right down below. I have everything that you would need, regardless of the community. If this one doesn't work for you and you're looking for something starting price a little bit cheaper, reach out to me and I'll get you situated. Of course, this is a three car garage. We can't go in there because you guys see what it says. Ashton Woods Construction Office. Here's our nice little uh, Harry Potter room. All right. I've seen bigger. This one doesn't turn to the right, but I do like to have a nice little shoe rack. So if you do enter from the garage, take off your shoes here, leave everything. And I'm pretty much gonna get, bring you guys outside. Um, upstairs, we actually have people walking that already bought this property actually, and they have a building. So we can maybe get their opinion, stainless steel appliances, of course. The thing that I really love about Ashton Woods actually, is the fact that if you want something done, they will do it. All you have to do is ask. One of the many things that I love about Ashton Woods is that if you want something done, that's maybe a little more customizable to the home, just bring it to them and they will do it. So for example, one of my clients actually asked me, they said, hey Brandon, do you know that little pasta arm that fills up the pots with water and everything? Wow, look at this backsplash. Um, and Ashton Woods is one of the very few builders that would actually include something uh, like that little pasta arm that brings uh, water through there. That's one of the few builders that actually uh, are willing and able to do that. Of course, this is an upgrade, nice railing. This would just be regularly a, uh, you know, the drywall would be regular wall there unless you opted for that. Back here, it's gonna be a nice little half bath. Very, very nice spacing. I love the design. Absolutely love everything. And then through this door, this is gonna bring you to your nice little back patio. This is roughly what the actual lot, if you were to purchase one of these, is gonna be. I believe this is the traditional series. So you're looking at a roughly 50 foot lot. Um, of course, if you wanted something bigger, you're gonna to have to pay the bigger premium. <laughs> but um, you know, it's all about your preference. I'm here to just present to you uh, the possibilities and options and details about this home. But this is, this is a very beautiful model. I cannot lie to you. Once again, the Griffin is a little, like the little brother to this, which is my dream home. But if I had a family and my girlfriend, you know, decided, you know, I'm gonna start a family or something. <laughs> uh, I'll probably need some bigger space. And one day I'll be able to do it. So we are pretty much done and through with the first floor of this house. I didn't open this up, but of course this is just storage. This is just storage and let's head upstairs where now you, I'm going to give you guys a little more of a taste as to what customizability you have with this floor plan and the Griffin because these floor plans are very, very similar. If you guys couldn't tell already, as soon as we get upstairs, we got options. We can go left or right. I am feeling like going to the left just because I'm going to be talking a lot on this side where majority of the options and upgrades are actually able to be able to do. Here we are, laundry room on the second floor. I'm pretty sure if you did want to add like a makeshift laundry room on the first, you can pay to get that water and wiring redone if that's what you want. Now you see this little loft, uh, the master bedroom is on this side, which we'll get to in a second. Here is where you're going to have a lot of customizability because this open to below concept is configurable. So let's say you figure that this is a little too small. You can actually add this extended. So it'll bring it from where it is now to pretty much the middle of there. You'll still keep the open to below. It'll just be a little shorter, but this will be fully extended. Or if you really, really wanted to, you can pretty much take away the open to below concept and extend this loft like all the way so you would have a really really big bonus room that i don't know if i'd be willing to get rid of the open to below because that's like a really nice feature of this house of course the wood beams is just done afterwards that's just like a builder's touch i don't know if i'd be willing to get rid of the open to below but i definitely probably extend it just so that way you know this could be like a movie kind of room or whatever but again another option if you did want to you can pretty much add a fifth full bedroom and full bath in this hallway here, 
but let's let's get to the tour actually i'm gonna open these two doors here just so you guys can see dual hvac you saw one here and in there this is going to be actual storage nice little linen all right now through here you're greeted with your master so i'm going to take my time it's very long lengthwise very big lengthwise you know um i do appreciate that i think it's like 11 by 19 or something 12 by 19 something like that but look at the big big windows very nice natural lighting in here dual doors as well when it comes to the bathroom and we're going to be greeted with another set of options of course that you guys can do and opt for if you chose to if your heart desires so this bathroom is just stunning <laughs> i don't know how i feel about uh no door being here just a lonely little toilet bowl by itself which is pretty funny but um dual sinks dual vanity right absolutely love this walk-in closet i'm going to show you guys real quick and then i'll tell you what the actual options are for this wow they got some nice cowboy boots nice stuff here guys yeah remember i did this video already yesterday so i'm already prepared it's just i didn't like the way it came out so i don't want to give bad content to you guys so here we are basically you can take a katana and whoosh, right down the middle add a freestanding tub here that's pretty much gonna push all of this back so this is gonna slide over a little bit and your walk-in closet is actually gonna be this way rather than in there and the toilet i'm not sure exactly where it's going to be to be honest but i do know if you didn't want this you would keep the two sinks but there will be a freestanding tub in there i'll see if i can add an actual photo of what that's going to probably look like for you guys just so you know oh and i forgot to tell you guys this is my lucky tie my girlfriend bought this for me marina if you're watching this i love you girl she doesn't watch my videos but <laughs> here we go here we go here we go from here, we already covered two bedrooms and we still got three more to go, which they're all actually gonna reside on the right side, which is why I decided to take the liberty of taking us from here back over here. So we're gonna make a right. Of course, this is gonna be a nice standalone full bath. Granite countertops, of course, dual sinks. So if you did have kids, right, this is probably the side of the house that they would reside on. You're nice and private in behind me in the master again. This is very ample sizing. This is why I like Ashton Woods is because they're very realistic when it comes to building these homes. This is of course a little bit higher end. So it's to be expected that they are gonna give more space, you know, nicer finishes, nice floor plan. But for what they're asking, you know, um, I would still probably build this in Maniola just to save some money. Bedroom number three. Um, and I will, I'll go over with you guys. Oh, this is a nice little surprise too. This is more of a New York style. I used to have this in my home in New York where they had the window in the closet. Ooh, look at the 350, my baby. Anyways, yeah, more New York style. Very, very nice windows, very big. Makes you not feel dead in this house, makes you feel very alive. That's why I have all this energy. Trust me, I'm like this regularly, but it's the houses that make me like this. They really do, so. <laughs> um, number three. We already saw that one. And then we have this very last one here, which is gonna share that same styling as far as that little walk-in closet with the nice window. And this is Ashton Woods, guys. I'm gonna tell you what the actual price points are now. Um, I think I made you guys wait long enough. So starting, this is the Duval, remember, starting in Winter Garden, the community we are in, they are actually just a touch over seven hundred thousand dollars i'm gonna set this camera up so i can just be stationary uh they're starting over 700 i believe it's like 720 and change starting so let's say you did 30 40 thousand dollars in upgrades you're just under 800 in the winter garden community if you stuck to um hills of mineola which i'm gonna link the video of the griffin you can build it there a lot cheaper right i believe probably like a hundred thousand dollars cheaper because the griffin is starting at like 580 so the duval is like at 650 there so pretty sizable difference almost a hundred thousand dollar difference of course these communities are brand new construction so they will offer incentives just make sure you reach out to me you know explain to me the situation that way i can kind of guide you the best way that i can 
and provide all of those details like the credits, the flex cash, incentives that these builders will offer and we can make something work for you. Um, if this home is too big, too luxurious, don't worry. I, I am very familiar with all the inventory in the central Florida market. So if you, so if you just discovered my channel watching this video, I do deal in much lower price ranges and higher. So just please give me a call if you're in need, if you're out of state, maybe from New York like I am, Toronto, I have a lot of clients that call me from there, any other state, or even if you're in Florida and you're just discovering me, my mission is pretty much to provide you guys value through these videos. I do my best, I stay up all night studying, making sure I know what's going on in the market. That way I can be your eyes and ears, whether you're planning on just coming here to visit, get a feel for the area, and then make a purchase later on, which is what I advise people to do. That's exactly what I'm here for, so yeah. So, so I'm just gonna drop the number one more time here, just in case you guys missed it. You can give me a call if you wanna have a consultation. I am very, very busy as I have many clients flying in from out of state, but I'm never busy enough to answer you guys. And if you guys leave me any comments, you know I answer absolutely everybody. So thanks so much for watching these videos. I'm gonna take this camera now because I've been talking for quite some time. And we're pretty much gonna get this wrapped up. We already went over absolutely everything that there is to go over, to be honest. Um, and my battery is dying too, which is great. So I think we can leave it there. Guys, much appreciation for watching my videos. Hopefully this one does well, because this is one of my favorite models. I will catch you guys in the next video. I have to go to Cocoa Beach for a client to do a showing. So I'm gonna edit this real quick, go to Coco, do my showing, and then, you know, on to the next. So I really appreciate you guys for watching. Make sure you subscribe. If you enjoy my personality, my content, uh, the kind of vibe that I go about things, information, thanks so much for watching, and we are out. I fixed the smudges on the screen, by the way.